Did you know that in the Kusu Annual Survey this year, of 31 colleges of Cambridge, Jesus College voted that they felt best represented by their JCRs? I think that's an amazing statistic, and I'd like to keep that up. Good evening, everyone. My name is Oregon B, and I'm running to be your JCSU president. The most important thing I think I can bring to this role is my experience. My time here so far has been unique to say the least. For example, I've been to an ethical affairs committee meeting, I've sat in on college council, I've met with pro vice chancellors of the university, and I could go on. But each time, I've had to defend the stance to people, to defend a stance to people in positions of immense authority. As a result, I've developed a resilience that um, that I think is necessary for JCSU presidents who hold a duty to defend and protect your voices in these tough situations. In the past, the college has attempt to, attempted to implement a communication strategy that would have effectively been able to limit what you said on social media. College has also attempted to implement um, a clause that would have been able to give a college the right to punish you if your behaviour outside of college made college look bad. But these two problematic causes um, have been shot down by our, JCSU, our JCSUs in the past because of their strong leadership. As your president, I will exercise the same resilience and ensure that we fight really, really hard to ensure that your voices are protected. In my manifesto, I highlighted key areas that I'd like to focus on this year, as opposed to more specific policies because I think that I'm here to represent your policies. West Court will be somewhat fully functional by January. Um, I think it's very important that student representation is considered when we are allocating the use of these rooms. For example, I'd like to look into negotiating with conference how we can make one of these rooms also a prayer room. I'd like to work with the communications officer about bringing JNet finally into the 21st century. Hello. Um, I actually met with the college communications officer, Helen Harris, this morning to discuss the feasibility of this policy. Looking into maybe getting a basic app that's just kind of for us to do things that we like to do very often, checking the cash card, booking formals, maintenance requests and things like that. I'd like to make the pres president's bulletin more regular, about two to three times a term. I'd also like to consult with freshers and incorporate them and the JCSU to basically talk about how we can better design freshers week. However, I do understand that if I'm elected, I'm here to be a voice for you and represent you in the best way possible. One of the best things about being with JCSU is being part of the team. I've been lucky enough to share the past year with 16 <coughs> other absolutely amazing people. I recognise that if I'm elected, I'm in charge of leading these people and this leadership presents its challenges. I think I am and have become, thanks to being a welfare officer, a good listener. And I think being patient and attention to the plights of others, students and other people in the committee, is key to being an effective president and I promise that I will continue to be a good listener. So, about... A couple months ago, the Guardian newspaper quoted me saying, what a time to be a Jesuit. Because I am really, really, really proud to be a member of this college. Like, okay, yes, it's weird and it's annoying because like, why are they still on my Tumblr? Like, that's just really weird. Like, <laughs> but, 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 they didn't lie. I am really proud to be a Jesuit. And this college community has played an integral part to why my time here has been so enjoyable. Four days before moving day, when I was a fresher, I burnt my thighs off with really hot oil. And my first ever encounter with the JCSU was with Daisy, who was then the welfare officer. And I came in and she knew all about my incident and it was her frantically telling me that she would do anything I needed her to do to help me. The JCSU has had my back from day one. And I think it's really, really important that the JCSU continues to be a support system for each and every single student at this college. And I hope you consider me capable and competent enough to ensure that that never changes. I promise my eyebrows will always be on fleek. <laughs> I promise that my dad will always be on beat. <laughs> but most importantly, I promise that I won't let you down. I faced very tough competition this evening, and you all have a really tough decision to make next week. But I hope that I've convinced you how passionate I am about Jesus, college, um, <laughs> and, and most importantly, that I'm the right person for the job. Thank you very much. Good night.